Welcome to the Tineo how-to video. This is a short video tutorial demonstrating the step-by-step -step process from purchasing your course to completing it and receiving your CE certificate. Let's get started. One way to access the AAMFT course catalog is to use the www.aamft.org slash learning web address. When selecting a course to purchase, you can search by category or topic. When you're ready to purchase a course, click the Add to Cart button. In order to purchase a course and access the Tenio Learning System, users must have an account. If you do not have an account, you can easily create one by clicking here. After logging in, this page will allow you to continue selecting courses for purchase while displaying the items in your cart in the right hand corner. At this time, you can also purchase additional AAMFT products and events by clicking on these tabs. When you are finished selecting courses for purchase, click the Begin Checkout button. Fill out your information for purchase. If you are a member or have already purchased courses, your information may already be filled out. Select Continue Checkout. On the next page, fill out your credit card information and billing address, then select Complete Checkout. Congratulations, you have successfully purchased your courses in the AAMFT online learning system. To access your purchased courses, click the link that is provided to you on the receipt or you may also access previously purchased courses from the AAMFT course catalog by selecting click here. Welcome to your personalized Tenio classroom where all of your courses purchased will be displayed. If you have more than three courses in your classroom, click on the plus button to expand your My Courses list. To enter the course, select the Launch button or click on the title of the course. Once you have opened this course, you will notice two tabs, a Modules tab and a Discussions tab. The Modules tab includes a list of activities where you will find all the course related modules. To begin the course, click on the module title where you will find a launch button. Depending on the type of course that you have purchased, this may launch either a video recording or it may launch an instructional PDF. Please note, some courses will have one module while others may have several. You will need to complete all the modules in order to receive your CE certificate. After each module, you will need to complete a module assessment. You may access the module assessment two ways. An option to take module assessment will appear in the top right hand corner after the course is launched. You can also return to the course page and in the list of activities, you will see a Take Module Assessment to the left of the Launch button. After completing a module assessment with a score of 100%, you will be able to continue to the Student menu. Please note, each module assessment only contains one question. You must pass each module assessment prior to attempting the final assessment. A final assessment button will appear in the top right of your activities box upon completion of all module assessments. Please note, prior to the start of the final assessment, the required number of correct responses will be displayed in the light blue box. If at any point you need to pause the assessment, click the Exit Assessment button in the top right corner. When you are ready to continue, the test will pick up where you left off. After you have answered all of the questions and received your passing assessment score, select the Training Menu button. Return to the list of activities and you will now see a Course Survey button. Click on this. Fill out every box in this form. If you have no additional comments, type NA into the comment section. 
Do not leave this box blank. After submitting your survey, select Return to Course and select Print Certificate. You can either physically print by selecting the print icon or save it as a PDF by selecting this arrow icon. It is important to remember to receive your CE certificate, you must pass all of the module assessments, the final assessment, and complete the course evaluation survey. Congratulations, you are now ready to start using your personalized online learning classroom.